Lotus Connections is enterprise social software that allows you to interact with your employees, your customers, or your business partners using a variety of different tools. It includes profiles, communities, social bookmarks, activities, blogs, and even aggregates them all together in our homepage. Today I'm going to take you through the communities piece of Lotus Connections. Lotus Connections Communities brings together people with a common interest or even a common skill and gives them a place to share and exchange information and ideas. Communities can be used inside your organization or can be used with people outside your organization, such as your customers or your partners, and help bring their ideas back in. This is the All Communities list, which shows me the most recently updated communities in my organization. From here I can also view what my communities are, the most popular communities, or see a full list of them in alphabetical order. I can also navigate them based on the tags that I see here in the tag class, so I can find out what community tags are most popular and filter based on those tags. Here I'm going to go into one of the communities I'm a member of, the Green Hands community. We can see that it's been tagged with awareness, environment, and impact, an area that I'm interested in. Inside the community, I can view some description information and also view those tags, but I can also see several sections related to the community. For example, here's where the, dis the discussion forum exists for this community and shows me the different topics that people in this community are talking about. I can go into the discussion forum right from here, and I can even add my own response to the items that we see here, or view a threaded or flat view of the discussion. You'll also see from the overview page that I can access some other applications as well. Here I can view all of the feeds that this community subscribes to. And within here I can go into a common feed reader view where everyone in my community has access to the same list of feeds and we can view information that comes from that feed all together in one place. Similarly, we can all view bookmarks together as well and share and exchange bookmarks within the context of the community that we're in. It's also important for communities to have flexibility in terms of what it is that they want to use to interact with each other. One of the ways in which we've provided this is by allowing communities to integrate with third-party applications. For example, this community leverages a wiki to do collaborative authoring. And here we can see that the community itself has its own wiki and that information from that wiki is being updated and pulled into the community view. Now this happens to be a social text wiki and we also do this type of integration with Confluence wikis as well. One of the key points about this integration is that as people add themselves or remove themselves from your community view, which you can very easily do here, the membership is actually managed and synchronized with those applications that are using the community list. So in this case, the social text wiki is getting its permissions from the Lotus Connections community that we see here. We also have third-party integration with another Lotus product called Lotus Same Time Advanced. With Same Time Advanced, every Lotus Connections community can also have a community in same time where they can do real-time discussions. For example, let's say in our Green Hands community, we wanted to send out a broadcast chat to everyone who is online. With Same Time Advanced, we can choose the broadcast chat option, as well as other things like sending an announcement, sending an instant poll, or even sending a skill tap. And if I send this broadcast chat, everyone who's online at the time will be able to view this particular item and be able, be able to respond in real time. Then once we're done, we can take this chat and save that back into our Green Hands community so that those of us who weren't online at the time will be able to benefit from having that chat transcript right within the community. Now when I come back to the community page and refresh, I can see that I have a new broadcast chat item that was added today. So I can access my communities and work with them using the tools that I use most frequently 
as well as the community pieces that are provided here by Lotus Connections. Thanks for your time today. Feel free to reach out to me if you have any further questions or check out my blog or the Lotus Connections page online. Thanks.